the YouTube Fish Breed 1000 here. I want to make a video for you guys. Um, it's going to be about testing the salinity in your saltwater aquarium. Um, this is a very useful tint or a sort of how to. Um, if you have a saltwater fish tank, you really should know how to test your salinity. It's very important to your fish and corals. Um, so the reason this water level is so low is, as you can see, I moved my 20 gallon reef tank. Uh, so I lost a little bit of water moving it. This I didn't get it all back in the tank. We'll leave it at that. But the water's level's low. I don't really want to have to open a big bag of salt to make like two gallons. So I'm gonna test the salinity and see how much I can, how much fresh water I can add without hurting the corals. So the things you're gonna need is a hydrometer. I have this Coral Life one. I mean, it works okay, but uh, that's it. I think it's a little off. Uh, and then something that I like to use, just because it makes my job, uh, everything easier, is I like to set down like this little rag. Set the hydrometer on that. And then, uh, let me see. I got a tricky baster here too. So, this is the tricky baster I used for the baby angelfish, which if you watched my last video, are gone, so I can use it to test the salinity. Um, so all I'm gonna do is it's so this is like a clean clean uh hydro uh sorry, turkey baster, clean hydrometer. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go into your aquarium, take out some salt water, and put it in your hydrometer. Now there's different ways of doing this. Some people like to just dunk the whole hydrometer into their aquarium. Some there's actually some hydrometers that actually can be left in your aquarium. I think those are pretty cool, but they sort of look ugly. So you're gonna fill it up trying not to spill as much as you can. And then you're gonna come down and read it. So either one of two things is happening with my aquarium. Either a ton of evaporation or my hydrometer is wrong. Um, but uh, the safe the safe area for coral a coral reef, it's nice to have your uh, salinity here uh, in between 1.024 and 1.026. For saltwater fish only uh, or saltwater just fish, you can go as low as 1.020. I've seen that done, but not for extended periods of time. All the way up to 1.026. Just the corals really do like the uh, higher salinity. Um, so, you always, testing salinity is always something good. Um, test it frequently, and that way you know whether you need fresh water, salt water. Get yourself a good hydrometer, know how to calibrate it. This was sort of one of those things where they told me I needed when I was setting up my first saltwater tank, so I bought it. They didn't know how to use it, so now it's all messed up. But uh, this is the 20 gallon reef. I hope you guys learned something. I'll be doing lots of little like tipped tips and tricks, sort of like that sort of stuff, on my channel from now on. So uh, if you like it, please subscribe, comment if you have any questions.